work today. Got a mile outside of town. I saw a little deer run across the road about a quarter mile up and thought, wow, it's a good thing that, you know, it did that then. Uh, but there was uh, like a little cut through the hill where they made the road. So there's two, on both sides, there's two like hills. And there's just a rock on the side. Anyway, and just the second after I thought uh, to myself, as long as another one doesn't jump out from behind this invisible wall where I'm not going to be able to see, that would be great. And then bam. So needless to say, I am headed back home and not on my way to work because of this. I hope you can see because I turned my phone around. That's the windshield. That's my window and my no longer uh, review mirror. And you can't see it through the Dollar General bag, but there's glass all over the car. So I'm going back home. And of course it's raining today and it's supposed to thunderstorm later. Until about noon. Um, we're gonna have to drive it like this, probably. Well, I'm gonna stop by the local shop here in town tomorrow. He has a blazer on his lot. Well, he was going to repair that one. But um, he's gonna see if he can't get a windshield to fit. So as much as I think I could just cover this up and head to work, it's raining. Um, I don't think I could fix it in the rain. The best I could do is fix it at one or two and I was only scheduled till five. So now, with not working today, I have racked up a whole 10 hours of work this week. Which means I need to work at least 40 uh, to have any kind of check. This is ridiculous. It's a good thing Jason got a little bit of a raise. So anyway, I'm gonna let you know. I'm headed up the hill and I just hope I don't spray too much of this nasty road orange mud water into the car. So, that's my day. I don't know if I'll vlog anymore today. I'm really not feeling up to it. There was glass all over me. I think there's glass inside my shirt still. Um, I don't know. I'll probably post photos of the damage after, but this is just a tiny check-in video to say hey. All right, well, it's the next day. I uh, took the truck up to the repair guys. I was supposed to be, an inspector was supposed to be coming by today. He thinks they're gonna total it because he thinks it's about two thousand, they're gonna say it's a couple thousand dollars worth of work because they have to make it all brand new because we were buying the car. and They won't use like salvaged parts, so I don't know. But if they do that, we still have to be able to have a little bit, they have to be able to give us enough to pay our deductible and buy another car. Um, supposedly we can buy it back and then have it repaired with a salvage title, but that depends on how much they want us to buy it back for. So we'd have to be able to make at least 500 for the deductible and three or five or six hundred dollars, whatever they'd want us to buy it back for, over and above what they pay. Yeah, you're off. Or if they talk to Dan, maybe Dan can convince him that it is fixable and here's he would only charge like a thousand to fix it. That way they don't total it and then he can do the work and he can fix it and minus the deductible he'll still get five hundred dollars. So anyway, luckily we did get a rental car. 
I'm going to be spoiled rotten. This is a 2017 Ford Fusion. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm going to get my old, old crappy truck back. <laughs> or have to drive Uncle Jerry's little crappy thing back and forth to work. It gets about 26 miles to the gallon. Average so far. Look at that thing. Doesn't use a key to start. Some of you guys probably have new cars and are like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Whatever. It has two USB plugs. That's my shifter knob. I haven't plugged my my phone up to the Bluetooth yet. I might do that. The radio stations are preset, which is cool. Um, like I said, this is one of those fob things, and it notices if I'm close enough to the car to start it. Let me start it without screaming it. Someone's trying to steal it. But what are those things? I don't know. But here's my new car for the next, I don't know, week or... Depends on how fast the insurance company does their job. It's from Oklahoma. Uh, the insurance company covers Enterprise for us up to $30 a day, up to $900 total. So we got it for a few weeks at least. I came out here to get my sweatshirts for work tomorrow. So I can wash them. Make sure there's no glass on them. So, anyway, it's been a blast. Uh, see you next time.